Hello friend, welcome back. In our previous video, I have discussed about the things with you, how you can add the images with using that image intervention package and also how you can resize it, right? So now in this video, I want to discuss about how you can add that multiple image at a time. So if you want to do that work better, first of all, I want to do, I want to create one of the model for this one and also I want to create one of the migration files. So if you want to create it, I think you already know about it, what exactly you have to do. So right now here, I want to do I want to create one of the migration file as a PHP artisan and then make, I also want to create one of the model that means like make model and I name it as a multi, okay, multi uh, picture. So that will be as a, our model name as a multi picture. Okay. And also I want to create one of the migration file as a M. So that will be also created one of the migration file and also it will be created one of the model. So now click as a enter. Now you can see it's now created our model and also it's created our migration file. So now if you go, that means here, so that is our controller and to the controller that is our model. So that is actually created one of the file as a model. That means one of the model as a multiple and also into the our database into the database area is created one of the another migration file that is our multi picture right so here i only want to take one field uh, for the images i take one of the one field and i just name it it will be as the image okay i name it one of the field name as the image and also it should be as a string okay it should be as a string so that's all. So now I want to do and to click the save all. So that means right now if you migrate it automatically, it will be created one of the table as a multiple pixels and also it will be created one field, right? So now I want to do and to migrate it. So here if you want to migrate, then you have to run as a PHP and artisan and migrate. Now click as the enter. Yeah, our migration is now successfully done. So if you now go to our database, into the database, there is a Laravel. If you refresh it, there is another one is added, is a multiple picture, that is a multi picture. And here I have added only one field as images. So now I want to do and to update our model. That means right now here we don't need this better. Here we don't need this, that is the app. Also we don't need this index, we need this. So that is our model. So into the model area, I want to do to update it. That means in our here, we have to also add that our protected fieldable. So I copy it from the brand. And now here after this, okay, after this, I simply add it. So that will be as a protected fieldable. So our fieldable field only they have the one field as the images, right? That means the image. So now I copy it. So our only one field there have. So right now we don't need this. So it should be only that image, right? So I make it as a, um, our fieldable. Now click as a save all. So right now we don't need our model. I remove it. So friend, first of all, I want to do, I want to add one of the menu. Okay, so here I want to add one of the menu for our multi image. So if you want to add this menu, I think you already know about it. If you go to our um, view, that means right now we don't need this if you go to our views into the views area that is our navigation drop down and with the navigation drop down right now i copy new one and here i save it and it will be as a multi image okay multi image so that will be our menu and here i want to do i want to create one of the um one of the url that means route for this one as a multi Okay, multi and then it will be as a multi image. Whatever you want, so right now I make it as a multi image. Okay, so now we have to do, we have to create this route. We have to create this route in our web route area. So now go to our web route. So after this, better here I put some of the note as a multi image route. So that will be our multi image route. I know here I want to create it. So better right now I want to do and to copy it. Okay, I want to copy it and here that will be as a multi image. I copy it and now I name it as a multi image. So friend here, if you want to create new controller, you can actually create it. So here you have to, you have to create another new controller for this one. So right now here, I, I don't want to create new controller, better into the brand controller. I want to create this method. I hope you already know that structure. So here, if you create one of the new controller, you can create it here. You have to add this new controller name and to the new controller here, you have to add that one of the method, right? 
So right now better I want to use it into the brand controller. So that will be our route name and here I name it as a multi image. Multi image. Okay, it will be as a multi image into the brand controller. I want to create one of the method. I name it as a multi. Okay, multi multi image or mul better multi picture. Okay, so this type of one of the method I want to do and to create in our brand controller. So now go to our brand controller. So first of all, we have to do we have to load one of the page, right? That means here I have already put one of the URL when the any user click into the multi images, it should be detected to our this method. So now into the brand controller here. Mm, after this. Okay, so here better I want to do and to put some of the note. So that is uh, that is for multi image all method. Okay, so here I want to do and to create one of the another method as a public and then function and then our method name will be as a multi image that means a multi pick right. So here what exactly we have to do first of all I want to do I want to load one of the page. So if you want to load one of the page, what exactly you have to do? You have to return it. That means a return and then view. So you do the return view here. I want to do. I want to. Uh, um, that is our view page. So that is our view, right? So there's route and then the view. So into the admin folder. Into the admin folder, I want to do. I want to create another new folder. Then it should be better actually. So into the admin, I want to create another new folder and name it as a multi piece. Okay, multi piece. So this type of one of the folder I have created and into the folder area, I want to create one of the new file. So here I create one of the new file and I name it as the index index dot uh, sorry <laughs> played dot PHP, right? So that will be our page. So here if you want to add that link, so it will be as a first of all as an admin folder and then the multi uh, multi make that sure our folder name as uh, a multi piece so I name it as a multi M U L T I P I C multi piece and here I have created one of the file as indexed right that means index blade.php so perfect this so that is our appropriate file location so now here I load it right so friend, I hope you already know about that basic fun functionality when that's our method will be run, then it should be returned redirect to the one of the view page into the admin If the admin. I have created one of the folder as a multi picture into the multi picture folder. It should be redirect, redirect to our index page. Perfect. So now I want to do I want to work in our index. So right now I want to do in our brand. Uh, like that is actually our brand index page, right? So here better I want to do and to copy it. So that means in our brand and there is our brand index. I copy everything from here. Okay, I copy everything from here and now in our multiple picture and into the index here I paste it. So right now I want to do and to actually customize it. So here we have to change a lot of the things right now here. We don't need this actually. Okay, that means that is actually our card. Uh, here we don't need this. Mm, that is our um, brand that means the all brand so I name it as a all picture or multi picture multi picture okay that will be as a multi picture and then that is our one of the div so here I want to take this div and here we don't need this I simply remove everything okay I remove everything from here and here that is our um, all brand add brand so here we don't need this add brand i want to make it as a so here i want to do and to change it i make it as a multi image multi image okay it should be as a multi image and that is our form into the form area that is one of the tape so here we don't need this brand name i only need our this brand image right so better here i want to do and actually remove this dev that means this dev yeah I remove this deb and only I need our this deb and this deb name I name it as image I name it as image and also it should be show some of the error if you want then it should be display this message with the images 
that means our field name is now updated and type is a file type and there's an add brand i name it as the add image okay that will be as the add image perfect so that's all you have to do and also the route i right now i want to do and i will create this route later and nc type will be needed a method will be as a post okay so friend that's all you have to do now let's check this out if you now click as a save all so now i refresh this space so now you can see there is actually another one as a multi image so if you click as a multi image yes you can see it's now successfully loaded that means a multi picture that is our here i want to display our images and you can see there is a multi images and also here you display our brand images so from here i want to do to upload uh, some of the images and after that there is the add image portion perfect so here i want to do first of all i want to complete our select portion that means if there have any images i want to get all that images and i want to visible it on here so if you want to do this type of work what exactly you have to do into the brand that is our index here i loaded our this picture that means this page right index page so now i want to do i want to use one of the look and warrant for get all the data so better i want to do i want to take one of the um, variable as the images images and now into the images with our model name i have already created one of the model so that is our model name as a multi piece right so now with this as a multi a multi piece and uh, so with this multi piece i want to do i want to get our all the data that means the all data right so if you use that your this that means this model that means here if you want to use it you have to also add it right so now i copy it so here also we have to do we have to use it before we use that our brand so now i want to do i want to use our new one so new one model name as a multi okay multi pics so that is our multi pics perfect so make that sure you add your model name so right now from here we can actually get all that our data that means so i get all that our multi image data from our this table that means the multi pictures table and i get the things with this variable and now if you want to pass this variable all the data you have to do you have to make it as a compact right so now i simply add that as a compact and compact with our this image data how much easy it is you can see friend so that is the main concept i hope you already uh, remember that part the main concept is should be already clear to you so right now we are using it so we get all the data from our multi picture table and take the things with this variable and here i pass it with the compact in the image with the images right now we can actually access all the images in our index space right that means right now we are able to access it into the here okay so here if you want to visible it you can visible it so i will do that things later so right now i want to do i want to upload that images okay so from here there is also one of the form so how can upload these images better i want to continue this process so in our next video i will show you that things with a live example so thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next video